Oh, yeah. Good weekend. It's raining at the moment, but fingers crossed it should, should be quite sunny. Get a little bit of a tan, we hope. Anyway, I'm going to take you along for the journey, and also when we're there, I'm going to take you all around the show, see what's going on. Um, by all accounts, it's meant to be quite busy. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. So, less of that. I've just done my shopping, got all my bits and pieces for the journey. Let's have a look. Look at all that lot there, that's all my bits for the weekend. Anyway, that's enough for me for now. Let's get back on the road, let's get there, and let's see what's happening. See you shortly. <laughs> So they put me in a queuing system and when I say there is loads and loads and loads of ants oh my god I've never seen nothing like this fingers crossed we'll be able to chop the drone up and get an air shot of it's a massive massive do here anyway I'm gonna switch the engine off sit here for a bit and Wait until we moved on and I'll get back to you a little bit later. We're here at the show and oh my god it's amazing I've never seen so many camper vans of all styles all shapes all sizes I mean I've just switched this on and look what's coming in now right over there a lorry and right beyond it you got your coach built so it's all sorts for all sorts here and obviously there's mine and if we do a little scan around 
I mean, look over there. Loads. I mean, everywhere. And we're going to go for a little walk in a second. But I think first of all, I need to put my microphone on the camera. But let's go for a wander. Right, so over there everybody is the YouTubers village. There's Luke's van from Luke's Van Life. You've got those weirdos. You've got the Wandering Womble. And you've got Greg Virgo. And also over the back there you've got Camper Vibe. I'm going to leave links to description in my description to all those. And this is the market area. Where all the stands and stalls are. Yeah, we've got a boat at the International Camper Van Show. Unbelievable, eh? But it's filling up thick and fast here now. And the queue of traffic is still going all the way around the track. Takes all sorts at these shows, you even get a boat. Unbelievable, innit? Anyway, I'm going to chuck the drone up in the air in a minute, so we'll get some aerial shots, get some good footage for you. I shall see you in a little while. And I'm back again and this time I've been told off yes I've been told off so as you just noticed I've got a bit of drone footage but and I've gone all over the site and then this friendly man in a van drove up one of the marshals he said I've got to have a kind word he said oh, you know there's a no-fly zone on site I didn't know but he was really nice about it you know what as far as marshals and people go, you know, he could have given me a right rollicking, but he didn't. So we've seen trucks, we've seen vans, we've seen cars, we've seen motorbikes, we've seen boats. So yeah, it's one of those shows where it looks like to me, anything goes. And I'm going to go for a walk a little bit later when it gets slow, starts to cool off a little bit. Because it's, it's about 8 o'clock now and it's still quite warm. And when it cools off, I'm going to go for a nice little wander around. And... I'll take you along for a walk. Um, I've spent some money as well. I've got flagpoles, but I bought another one. Look. I think it's about three or four flagpoles now, but there is a reason for this one. Um, I've not just bought it for the hell of it. I bought it because we're gonna get a built, not bought flag done. And them flags up there are big but we're gonna go humongously big so I'm gonna have a huge flag on there and probably put the Victron flag that we've got underneath that but that'll be on the new van once my new van's done that's an exciting build oh my god it will be such an exciting build and then once then I'm gonna get rid of everything I own move into the van you'll probably think I'm joking but I'm not I'm gonna anyway I'm gonna leave you to it for now i'm gonna go and have a beer i sit down soak up some of this glorious sun and i'm gonna pop over to the youtubers village a bit later on over that over that side you're probably wondering why i'm wearing such a bright t-shirt i'll show you so the reason with the t-shirt we have the built not bought logo there and we also have it on the back So we've got it on the back and the front. That's why I'm wearing such a loud t-shirt. So when I walk around, people see this. And we've already had been asked for stickers already. And people have been looking around the van. I still haven't put the for sale sign up yet, but I've got to put that in it in a minute. So yeah, I bought a for sale sign to go in the window. 
um, if anybody's interested in this van I'll be doing a van tour over the weekend then hit me up in the comments and we can chat about it right as I said I'm gonna go because I'm gonna drink a beer nothing too strong any a Budweiser and I'll be back to you shortly <laughs> Hi everybody, as you can hear, it's absolutely noisy right now. And that's because I'm here with a guy called John, who's got your typical built not bought camper. Um, so hello John. Hi oh, there. No, you should have said hello John, but never mind. <laughs> <laughs> We're all comedians. Right, anyway, right. It. Yeah. When I show you this, this is off the rails. By a long shot, off the rails. Well, let's start at the back. Look at this. Cooking. What is this? What car is it? Or was? It's um, a Volkswagen Jetta Mark II GTI. Used to be a race car. Couldn't part with it. Cut it in half. Used to be your race car. Used to be my race Couldn't car. part with it. Couldn't I mean, part with it. you got to look at this. Unbelievable. And what I love the most, we're all about built, not bought. Look at that, people. Built, not bought. Built, not bought. Obviously, you sleep, innit? My friend Sam has done a lot of work. Sleeps in it. Imagine the sleep pod. It's amazing. Look at this table, unbelievable. So I've been told to have a look in the engine bay, so let's have a look at the engine, shall we? So we've gone a little bit crazy on here, have we? So tell me a little bit about this. It is only a 1.9 diesel um, TD, but it's out of a Golf. Um, but what we've done is put a hybrid turbo on it, put an absolutely massive intercooler on it, um, and just played around with it a little bit. Yeah. A lot of people say to us, what's the other battery on the other side? I always say to them it's one of those new batteries that you don't need cables for, but the actual battery is a toolbox, so you can actually take the top off of it. It's got the tools in it. A toolbox. It's a tool. <laughs> this is not a battery, it's a toolbox. Yeah. Oh, come on, show me. We need to see this. So. My colleagues at work went crazy when they got hacksaw to it. Going, what are you doing? But, oh my God. So this redefines my channel completely as far as built not bought campers goes. Because this is absolutely off the scale. And I always look to find something new. And this is just amazing. I'll tell you guys, you've outdone me by a long shot. I don't think I could ever go get this bad or this absolute crazy. I mean, look, come on. I love this. I should be driving around in something like this. <laughs> am I that brave? Yes, I am. That's the problem. Anyway, that's enough for me and this vehicle. Enough from John and this beast. Beast of a built, not bought camper. And we'll show you some more a bit later. Absolutely unreal. You should be proud of yourself for this. One of the miniatures. Sporting our badge. Look at that. Oh yes! Like I said, it takes all sorts here. You'll see campers and everything. Oh, I tell you. I don't think I'm going to have enough time to go around all this. But I'll do what I can and I'll get as much of this to you as possible. 
is it. That is the end of the International Campan and Overland Show for June 2021. I do hope you've enjoyed watching the video today and I know it may have been a bit longer than normal but there was so much stuff to see at that show. Trucks, bikes, cars, everything and even yes boats. There was a boat there. I don't know if I to change the video. Well anyway, I've had a great weekend, hot weekend, very burnt summer.
Hamburg weekend. It's been good. And no doubt we'll be back at the September show as well. Anyway, that is literally it for today and being on all campers and all the crazy stunts of the weekend. So, I hope you're all staying safe. I hope you're all staying very, very well. And most of all, staying very, very happy. And that's it, and it's bye from me for now. Bye.